What's up guys, XRKiwis here and welcome back to another video. As always, really appreciate you clicking on a video and choosing to support the channel. If you could of course leave a like, comment down below and subscribe if you haven't already, then that would be really appreciated. Um, as always with these videos, I'll show you my um, team, player instructions, custom tactics, etc. And then go and open the packs. So this is the team that I used um, at the weekend. I sold Vieira because I'm going to complete his SBC. I've already done most of the challenges. So I can do him for really cheap with all the untradables I get. I sold Alisson because honestly he's horrific. Um, he is horrific. One of the worst goalkeepers I've ever used. I don't know if to try Alisson or not. But um, um, not Alisson, Edison, sorry. But yeah, I, I needed to get rid of Alisson. And then Lacazette. Lacazette's a weird one because the first like 17, 18 games he was absolutely unbelievable. But the last 12 or so he was awful. He went from so good to so bad. So I think I'm just going to try different players in that striker role. Um, you'll see down at the bottom I've got Aguero. Not really a fan of him either honestly. For the 2 million mark it doesn't feel great. His shooting is insane. But he feels slow. I don't know why. Every single year, whether he gets a team in the season or not, his cards just feel slow. I don't know why. He just does. He's got all right stats for me, to be fair, considering uh, six of them are div rivals as well. But, yeah, he's got 99 acceleration. He just does not feel like it. His stats are incredible, but he just he doesn't feel right. I don't know why. I'm going to sell him for 2 million coins anyway. Um, take these concept players out, so... I can do that and show the custom tactics because for some reason it doesn't let you do it. Uh, put anybody in there and then CDM would go in there. Um, yeah, so custom tactics are the same as always. 4 1 2 1 2 2. Balance, 5 width, 4 depth, fast build up play, 4 4, and then 2 2. Um, I've played this for well probably since the start of FIFA so I'm honestly not a big believer of custom tactics I don't think they'll make much of a difference to your weekend league depending on what you play like if you just play balanced your weekend leagues will basically be the same to be honest if you play constant pressure then you could be in a bit of trouble but um yeah just normal ones I don't see much of a difference and then play instructions uh, again behind and stay forward on the strikers stay forward on the cam Stay back while attacking on the CDM. And then stay back while attacking on the fullbacks. Um, any questions, of course, let me know in the comment section. And I'll try and happily ask and um, answer it. But, uh, yeah. Um, been playing squad battles. Got a few games to catch up on that. But that's fine. A little bit boring, but it's okay. Um, we'll take the two ultimate packs. At this stage of the game... I'm going to start completing loads of SBCs, so hopefully I can just take untradables and pack some high-rated players. And then foot champs rewards. We did finish Elite 2. Um, it was weird. I was 19-0 and 0 and went to 25-5. and 5 And it just felt like I couldn't uh, control my players. I could have played, like, no exaggeration. I could have played someone that couldn't even qualify for foot champ. And I could have lost after, the, like... 19th game players just turned into bronze players oh, I'm, I'm gonna have to discard that guy um Saul at the end just because he's an untradeable duplicate that I packed last night um right uh oh I need to get Twitter who am I getting oh Sancho's not bad apologies I looked away from the screen because I looked at Twitter to see who I could actually pack Sancho's not bad actually I used this future star card and he was brilliant but he couldn't finish. And I'm guessing that's just because of his composure. Um, honestly, I don't don't want to sound ungrateful. But it'll probably go into an SVC for me. You guys have seen my team now. And it's pretty good. A card with 72 composure. I just I don't think I could use him. It'd be an amazing sub. But as a 96 rated, I don't think I'd keep him as a sub. However, I'm definitely going to take him. I'll give him a go, nonetheless. But I just can't see him being great because of his composure. See, that's what I thought we'd get. Sommer Trap. Do I... See, this Da Costa looks brilliant. But I don't think I can get him on Kim. 
because I need Desai to strong link to Mendy, and then I've got Van Dijk, who doesn't strong link to anybody, and no Germans. So, you know what? I'm going to take him anyway. The 95 rated player isn't going to make much of a difference to me, so I'll take De Costa and see if I can fit him into the team. And then last pull, Tellez, again, a really good pull actually, but I just can't get him on Ken. I mean, actually, I can. I can just swap him straight away for Mendy. You know what? I'll take Tellez. Very usable reds there, actually. A lot of people would happily take any of them, let alone all three. So, yeah. It's just at a stage where my team's that good now. Like, not, not pay to win either. Chucking it out there. Everyone who knows me knows that I play the game to actually earn that team. I've grinded this game a lot. But, yeah. Really good reds. Tellez and De Costa, I will try and get in the team. And Sancho, I'll use him, but I can't see him being good. 72 composure is very low. Um, right, the 100k packs and ultimate packs last week, I didn't get a single walkout somehow. Still no walkout in 100k packs. Packs are just so bad this year. Um, oh, people still ask me um, why I'm not streaming on Twitch, on Twitch at the minute. The only problem is my OBS, I cannot get to work. Um, my settings and everything have completely messed up and I can't get them back to what they were or what they need to be at. Like, if I stream now, it's just really bad quality and lags loads. So I can't currently stream. If anybody who's like an OBS or PC expert or someone could get the time to message me on Twitter, I leave my um, Twitter in the description every video, then that would be really appreciate it because at the minute I'm streaming off the Elgato which is really good quality but doesn't allow me to stream or a face cam. We do get balls though. It's only an inform. I don't know who's team of the week to be honest. Nobody good I don't think. Carlos now. What vacancy now is an inform? 87? Eh, not bad. I might sell for a little bit just due to SBCs and stuff here and there. Anybody else in the pack? Again. Not a bad pack for me though. I mean, I say he might sell, he's untradeable, which is actually even better for me because now I'll put him into the Vieira SBC. Felipe Luiz always goes up so much as soon as any sort of SBC comes out of anything. I've got 18 duplicates. I'm not going to waste my time with most of them. Um, just make sure I do the Bundesliga players, which somehow I only got one. Cheers, game. Um... Right, send you up. Send however many of the first ones that I've done. De Rossi, Pastore, and then get rid of him. So, yeah, anybody who knows computers can message me. That'd be appreciated. Also, somebody said um, last week in the comments, it made me laugh, actually. They were like, being that you got a really good pull now when I got Team of the Season Aguero, it was like, considering you got a good pull, are you going to stop moaning about the game every video? And that just makes me laugh how somebody can think that one decent pull makes you completely forget about the whole game that we've been playing this year. Again, walk out no team of the season. Is that De Bruyne though? That's not bad. Um, 91 rated. Again, he's untradeable, so it'll just go into an SBC because I've got his team of the year. But 91 rated card. Two walkouts in the ultimate packs. A lot better than usual. My rewards today have actually been insane. The, f the red cut, the red picks were so good. And the fact that I've packed two 85s, an 87 in form, a normal in form, and a 91 De Bruyne is ridiculous, to be fair. Um, I'll swap the 83s over. But, um, yeah, how people can just sit there and think, we've played this game for, what, about eight months now, is it? Even eight, nine months, even more somehow? And people think that one good pack pull can just wipe that out of the way because I've got a good pull. Which, to me, is quite funny actually. Just describe some of the people's mental state that they play this game. But anyway, one team of the season pack here. I don't know who I'm hoping for. Somebody high rated, somebody that goes for a lot. A Royce would be nice, obviously. But yeah, there's quite a few just average players like Trap, Sommer. Watch, watch the swish flag come straight up here. German. Yeah, see, trap. <laughs> no, it'd be one of the 85 goalkeepers. Long one walks out. Um, 
Can't really get anybody good now. De Costa would be okay. Witzel would be alright. Um, Gnabry okay. But, yeah, not many players that we can get here. Havertz to the 95 could still be in here. He won't be, but he could. Who is it? Oh, that's a bad pack. He's going for 100k. He's probably going for less. Yeah, 90 traps, probably about 100 just because of his rating. I mean, we still made 300k off it, which, I mean... After the team of the week packs that we've seen all the way through the year is still good. But considering to what you can get. Like you saw me last week make over 3 million coins. Compared to what you could get it's a very bad pack. But considering what I got last week and the reds that I got this week and the ultimate packs. I am more than happy with the rewards that I got this week. Of course let me know down in the comments down below who you got. Just so I can be jealous when I see all them voices and um, Lewandowski's and people. Havertz as well but um, yeah hopefully you guys have good luck on the rewards I really appreciate you all being here and watching the video if you could of course leave a like comment down below and subscribe if you haven't already then that would be very much appreciated that's going to be the end of the video for me guys thank you for watching